Good morning and happy Monday. I'm Andy Ross. I'm one of the pastors at Northminster Presbyterian Church in Tucson, Arizona. And I want to talk with you at the beginning of this week about going out into deep waters. Can you just pause and remember how you feel emotionally when you first got into a pool or a pond or the ocean where your feet could not touch bottom? Do you remember how you needed a flotation device or you needed to practice those swimming skills to stay afloat, tread water? I, I bring this up because in our schedule of scripture readings for today, we're in the Gospel of Luke. Luke has such marvelous stories. And uh, today we're in chapter five. Jesus is talking to a group of, I think, weary fishermen. They're cleaning their nets. The night is done. They're packing up their stuff. And Jesus quite audaciously said, put out into the deep waters and let your nets out for a catch. And there's a reaction, uh, a pretty critical reaction. Simon Peter says, Master, we've, uh, you know, leave the fishing to us. Uh, we've been fishing hard all night, haven't caught a sardine. Um, I think there was a long pause as he saw that Jesus wasn't going to relent. And, uh, and then he says, but if you say so, um, I'll let out the nets. I'd like to ask you to think about setting out, pushing out into deep water. What are the ways that we as Christian people can set out in areas that seem uh, risky, relationships that gives us an emotional feeling like our feet can't touch ground, maybe you're not in your comfort zone, or maybe like those fishermen, you're just tired and weary. You feel like you've done, quote, your part right? Who are the people, what are the situations where you can take a risk and let out your nets in a new way, a new area, deeper waters, where Jesus will help us catch people in the net love of Jesus Christ? Got a floaty? How will you try that this week? Pray about it. Think about it. What are the deep waters of fishing for people's life's heart, souls that Jesus is asking you to try? Have a great Monday, and let's, uh, let's look for each other out in the deep waters of being a witness for Jesus Christ in this world today. God bless you.